Hey, how's it going? Today, I'm going to show you how you can translate text in a PowerShell script. It's very simple. Just follow me. The first thing you need to do is click on this link right here. So go ahead and click this link. On this page, you'll find all the source code you need right here. So, let's go ahead and copy the source code. Just highlight all the text and press Ctrl C to copy the source code. Now, let's open a text file and paste all of the source code. You can paste the source code by pressing Ctrl V. As you can see, it's a very short script. So, let's try and run the program without modifying the script and see what happens. Go ahead and run the script now. As you can see, something happened. But what? Let me explain. First, let's look at line number 5 to line number 8. This PowerShell script just translated this piece of English text into French. So, this is how you would say, let's have some fun in French. Now, let's change the script a little bit to do something different. Suppose we want to translate the text into Japanese. What are we supposed to do? Well, we have to change the destination code from FR for French to the destination code for Japanese. But how on earth do we find the destination code for Japanese? Well, it's actually easier than you think. Just click on this link right here for a complete listing of all the language codes. So, let's scroll down and find Japanese. Here it is. The language code for Japanese is JA. So, let's plug in that value into the script. Type JA to specify the destination language. While we're at it, why don't we get a little creative and change the text we're going to translate Let's say, I am very happy. Now, let's run the script again to see what happens. Go ahead and run the script now. See, this is the Japanese text for the sentence, I am very happy. If you also want to be happy and have some fun, try out the API for yourself. If you want to use the API for serious use, remember to subscribe to a plan. Thank you for watching. See you next time.